What's up folks, Sean the Average Angler. Thanks for tuning in. Today we got a little short video here to share a money saving tip for you that uh, I'm sure all of us have experienced over the years. And that is, I got a new toy too, so that thing's supposed to follow me. A lure retriever. And this is called the Hound Dog. It's a big chunk of lead with these loops that attach to your line then slides down the line. And what I do is use an old reel. This is just the Abu Garcia Revo S from many bygones and a broken rod that I picked up from my local tackle shop that someone had brought in for a warranty. They cut off the numbers they needed and I said, hey, can I have the handle? So I got a new handle, taped up the end so that it's not gonna fray and then the other nice thing about that is it's long enough to reel that up on there so that it stays all right this one is really good for swim baits crank baits that kind of thing and then if you're fishing jigs or other bottom bouncing stuff you can get yourself these picasso Heavy hitters, they're called. They come with two, probably three ounce lead weights. And you can tie on to the weight. And then you have the clip there to attach to your line and slide down on your line. Now, the reason you want it hooked to the line is because oftentimes you need to lift and drop, lift and drop a few times for it to break that lure loose. So... This is 80 pound braid. I would use 80 to 100, something like that. 80's always worked great for me. You can see by the paint knocked off of that that this one's been through the ringer. I've had it for years. So, saves you lots of money. Oftentimes the first lure that you knock out and get back, depending on what you're throwing, may pay for itself in one time. If you're throwing a Mega Bass, Lucky Craft, one time, and it paid for itself. I am Sean the Average Angler. Thanks for watching. If you like this kind of content, like, subscribe down below. We appreciate you taking the time to watch the video. Peace out.